Hello? This is her. I'm doing well. Great. <laughs> Nope, just still waiting for the call about the... Okay. Thank you. Bye. I thought that was the call, but it was just the surgery center making sure I felt okay. They said that there was one case left that they're working on and they'll call me soon. Welcome to today's video. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog. So if you like this video, come back tomorrow. Um, we're waiting to hear how many of my eggs fertilize anxiously. And hopefully I'll get some news soon. Okay, so they called back not long after um, that last call had ended. And so out of the 16 eggs they retrieved, 15 were mature and eight of them were fertilized. So that's a really, really great number to have. We're so grateful, like we've never gotten this far before. It's like, I've never been pregnant. This is just, that this point has never happened for us. And so we were really going to be grateful for anything with 16 being a bigger number. My head, I was like 10, um, but eight is really, really close. And so we're celebrating today for sure because this is really happening. And we'll have our fresh transfer of an embryo on Saturday. And then I'll get a call on Sunday to find out how many are going to be available to um to freeze for the future and so obviously nothing is guaranteed until then we have five days for these to grow and grow and grow and to develop the way that they should and um so we would just appreciate any good vibes and prayers and um just specifically for these cells to continue to grow and grow and grow make it to blastocyst so that they're able to transfer and that we have some on ice for backup. Hey everybody, I made gumbo. I didn't make, I didn't make gumbo. I'm having an allergic reaction. So we're gonna email our study nurse to see if she can take allergy medicine. I think she's gonna be able to, but email her quick, it's quick. It's just Claritin. Yeah. And we're going to uh, Taco Tuesdays. Ayo, ayo, ia, ia, oh. We need to go grocery shopping. We do. But I also don't feel like cooking. Yeah. Got lots of tea. You know who else has lots of tea? Everson Rex. Show us those crooked little tiny teeth. Come on, show us the front teeth. Put your tongue away. Put it away. Put your tongue away, please, and show us your teeth. Show me your teeth. Oh! You're the cutest single thing in the whole universe. Look at this display. I like that they're not like traditional flowers. We can yeah. probably keep some of these forever. Yeah. These are similar to the ones we have in the... the philodendron. Yeah, and so these are similar too, but these are flower. Thank you, Karen and Kayla. Yes, thank you so much. It's perfect. <laughs> we also got a thank you card. I didn't even show you this there. We got a thank you card. I went to the P.O. Box from Sean and Caroline. For the wedding. Aww. Thank you guys. It was a super sweet message. And now we have to go celebrate our eight zygote no zygotes seagoats some scientific terminology for a, a fertilized egg. egg not an embryo though yet with tia wana flats taco tuesday run city relax city calm city back at the t flats back at the tia wana flats this is my favorite part of this restaurant all the sauces I actually didn't go over the top with my sauces, so I remember what they are. This is habanero. This is jalapeno. This is Jason's mom sauce, which I know they have at Lazy Moon. This is like Vidalia onion and garlic, and this is sweet chili. I got Jason's mom and the, this ghost pepper one that's supposed to be super ridiculously hot. Oh my gosh! So I think bad. I got that last time. I don't think this is the smartest move with me going to run in like 45 minutes, but 
I, I got Powerade, so. That's a good one. <laughs> doing, being preemptive there. Alrighty, here is our meal. Peter got refried beans and black beans, and I just got black beans, but we might do a, mm. a little switcheroo. There's no mic there, she just requested it. <laughs> um, but all of this was $13. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, we just parked at the boardwalk? And look at this, they opened up part of the parking lot that they were redoing or building. We are the first parking spot next to this little turn spot. Yeah, it's just a little turn. You can see them so good from right here. Mm -hmm. We got Chip and Mrs. Potts. We got a yellow one. We got another yellow one. We got a purple one with some girl having the best vacation of her life over there. We got C3PO and R2. We got Who We Do We Louie. We got everybody. There's a bunch of, oh, look at those. Those are the little snow guys from Frozen. Look Mama at them. Odie. Where's Mama Odie? It is Thank Mama you know. Odie. So, like I said, we're at Disney's Boardwalk Resort and Convention Center. I took a really nice relaxing day today, but I had to get out of the house. Yeah. So I'm gonna relax here for a little, for just a little. She's not even leaving Boardwalk. She's got a book, mm -hmm. she's got her drink. We're gonna get her a nice spot in the solarium. Not the solarium, because it's not here, right? No, we're gonna get you a nice couch to sit on somewhere. Yeah. And I'm gonna go walk around. Gonna go on a little run, don't know how far. Supposed to go three, might go six, might go eight, might go 20. Might you go into Epcot. We haven't even talked about our eight fertilized eggies. We haven't? You did. I have, I said you have. Oh, I feel like the luckiest man in the entire universe. I'm still very nervous and scared about certain aspects between now and when we like 100% know there's a baby cooking in that <laughs> oven. Got lots of checkpoints. Yes, so, uh, but. We've never known. We've like never one been of the told. Days. We never knew if fertilization could happen for us, and now we know. Regardless of what happens, the the best happens if the worst happens. We know now that fertilization can happen. So regardless, I feel Win. like a trillion dollars. I am the king of the world. I'm the what's that? Matt show. Oh, anything goes. Let's say it. How does it go? You're the top. You're the Coliseum. You're the top, you're the Louvre Museum, you're a melody from a symphony by Strauss, you're a Bendel Bard and a Shakespeare son, and you're Mickey Mouse. So for the very first time I read this little plaque that goes along with this canvas, you can pause to read it, but I like this part where it said, visitors to the Seaside Resort are not in a serious mood and do not want to encounter seriousness. Here she is, a relaxing girl, relaxing in her place called the Boardwalk Resort. Don't you We're agree that- the Bellevue Lounge? No, that's it. No, this is, this is the Bellevue, it's the Bellevue Room. <laughs> and there's the Bellevue Room, which is the floating bar that I think is going away eventually for quick service. Yeah. But we're on the balcony outside, secretly covered because it's it is- called the Belk. Oh, it's called the Belk? So we're at the Belk, not the balcony, but the Belk. Yeah. There knows I despise. What are those called? Abbreviated. Abbreviated words like that. Like. You should look at the pretty pink flowers behind you. You can call me flower if you want to. Oh yeah. Those are pretty. I've got my running shoes on. Secret, secret. Underneath these shorts are my running shorts. I came fully prepared to go running around this boardwalk. But this my. Is what I'm gonna do. She brought her book. What book did you bring? She brought you. three miles per hour. That's from Karen and Kayla, who also sent us that lovely arrangement. But those came on different days, because they're super nice. Yeah. I love that you can see Peter's like sack mark from his work outfit. It means I need to get bigger socks, I think. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm gonna go run. Don't know how long, don't know where to. I'm gonna go in Hollywood Studios, ride rock and roll, go straight back. <laughs> oh no. I'll be a little bit when I'm back. Have fun reading. If you move, text me please so I, I can find you. I will. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Probably the earliest I've ever gone on a run here at the boardwalk, but it is like 8 o'clock. It's 7.52. So I think I've run here at a different time of the year when it was darker than it is now, but it's still pretty bright and pretty active. So 
so it'll be a good run. How long did you go? Three miles. This is what I was scheduled to do for my training. I want to do six because I. What did I do? I, I missed a six mile run? You did a three mile run with Steve instead of a six mile. Yeah, so I need three miles to catch up on. But it's so humid right now. The air is still. And the worst part? We just had to on a flat, so my stomach was a rock the whole time. Uh -huh. And I couldn't even burp freely because I'm at the boardwalk. I want to burp at some little kid's face as we're on vacation. I want to show the cutest little top of your hair. Is my colic showing? Yeah. When you realize that uh, Tijuana Flats with no meat in it is not enough for a whole night, you grab some Wild Wonders Gourmet Medley of Cherry Tomatoes and Tex-Mex Snack Mix. And you don't give any to your vicious puppy. Oh, it's too late for that. Also, is the holiday a Christmas movie or is it not? I say it is in fact a Christmas movie and Sarah says it is a Halloween movie. Mm -mm. I think that the holiday is like it, you know, how people from the UK say they're going on holiday. It just happens to happen at winter. Happens to have during the holidays. The daily message for today is by Benjamin Franklin, good old Benny F. Never ruin an apology with an excuse. Oh, I like that. Eve is notorious. Ice Cube. Good girl. She's notorious for giving excuses with her apologies. Alright, so me and Eve have sufficiently exhausted the little pup. <laughs> um, we were just running around like crazy, so we're gonna go to bed, finish this movie, and wake up. Mm -hmm. So Rejuvenated. Yes. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. Thanks everybody for your awesome messages. Yeah. Oh, also for you guys wondering, we don't get like a midweek update from the embryologist. It's typical for normal IVF for you to get a day three update yeah, from your embryologist, but we don't get that because of the study, like it's part of the rules. We'll get it on day five Saturday when we go in for the procedure. Alrighty. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.